Hello everyone, how are you guys? So today I wanted to share with you three items that I'm about to list in my Etsy store. This one is um, kind of, uh, it's a little petite one and uh, this one measures just exactly seven inches. Actually, it's just a little over six and a half inches. So unfortunately, the iPhone 7 will not fit in here. It's quite snug. I mean, it's, it's quite snug if you put it in there. So, um, but uh, yeah, it's a little petite one. And um, I did design the, the, the inside part as well. And it does have, uh, again, three um, ID slots there for your ID card and then with with my personal use I, this is almost like um, catch-all po pocket back there so and and the coins I usually just put in here as well and they usually stay just fine and uh, and so that's what it looks like and I did a little bit of embroidery stitching on there um, I'm not very good as far as you know trying to um, coordinate some of the colors but I think it turned out really good you know um, if I worry too much on what goes with if it's gonna match I'll never get a project done so I just go for it so uh, if you're having that same issue I, I, I just have to tell you just go for it and um, it actually I think it turned out um, rather um, cute um, and then the inside lining, I also, um, I dyed that with a uh, flower. It's a, uh, it's actually a rose petals that um, I use. It's fresh rose petal, and I just simply pour hot water in it and then, and, and steeped it like a tea would, I suppose. And then I just soak my, my fabric on there and it turned out really good. Um, I use, this is actually a white uh, fabric, so I love how it turned out. So, yeah, so this is going to be listed in the shop, and uh, I have to say, this is quite petite one. Um, the, the cash definitely fits in here, um, but, but your phone, if you have iPhone 7 or larger, definitely not going to fit. In this wallet so your cash fits nicely in there so it's a good little um, on the grab wallet I love mine I use it all the time and um, and I've had it for two years now and I just absolutely love it I still enjoy it and like I said I always get compliment on it specifically with the detailed work so um, so that's one, and then um, I went ahead and sewed this bag. I have two of these. It's a cute little shoulder bag. When I was younger, I, I shared this with you guys before. When I was younger, I used to carry a linen ba bag for, um, for school, and I just put all my books in there. So this measures 12 inch. By 13 and and it has a long strap I love long straps so the strap is about 23 inches long design on there um, I want to say almost like a jacquard print, uh, fabric and um, and I just love it I didn't put any lining because the inside is just as beautiful so I went ahead and uh, cleaned up the stitches and almost did the um is it called the french ham so no raw edges there so this way nothing will get caught in whatever you're gonna put in there so i think the inside is just as pretty as the outside so um yeah it's just a, a simple bag my daughter actually um Caught, uh, saw him last night when she came down here to um, to work out a little bit and she saw the bag and I'm going to show you right now which one she really liked and, and I think they turned out really good just for you know a little weekend bag or whatever you know project bag 
So that's one. I do have two of those. Um, so I didn't put lining on those. And then this one, she fell in love with this with this print. She fell in love with this bag. Now this bag, it's a little long. Let me measure it. Um, so this bag measure 12 and a half by 15. So it's a little bigger than the other one. It's just so pretty. And then I lined the inside because the embroidery on it. This is again, this is almost like a, a jacquard print and, and the, um, the fabric is just so nice and um, heavy because these are almost like upholstery bag. Uh, upholstery fabric that I, I grabbed from the um, the shop and um, I lined this one because of the um, embroidery um, thread on the back of it so so this is lined with cotton fabric and it's got a really nice weight to it in compared to the other one there but she fell in love with this one um so i use i use this particular um fabric it's almost it's not quite gray yet i want to say it's on the like a purple so it kind of almost matched this purple so i thought that would be that would night go really nicely on it and i decided to um do the other side of the strap with the same lining. I thought it turned out really nice. So that's one. I think this is the one that she wanted. So I don't know which one I'm going to be listing um, because this is the only fabric I have of this. So again, it's the same thing. Uh, just really beautiful fabric. It almost feels like... Um, linen very soft and uh just a beautiful beautiful artwork floral uh embroidered on there is so beautiful on this one i used the yellow lining you say yellow lining and and the stitching is really nice and clean so um you don't have you, you there won't be anything that'll uh, snag whatever you put in your bag so um, again, this measures the same size, but uh, like I said, I think this might be taken already because I think this is what she wanted. She thought she just fell in love with the color and the, the design of the fabric. So, all right. So that's those are the three. And then I'm going to um, get ready to get busy here again in my shop and um, start doing a different project. And... Uh, and go from there so yeah if you're interested with any of these um feel free to just come visit my etsy shop so and the link is listed below so anyway i'll let you guys go i hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend happy memorial day weekend and um uh, yeah be have fun out there tomorrow and uh be safe all right thank you so much for watching you guys take care and we'll talk to you real soon Bye bye